Hey everybody, welcome to another awesome episode of I Cook Better and Your Mom. Let me start off by saying I'm really sorry I haven't uploaded any videos recently, but I've been very sick for the last two weeks. But today, I promise I'll make it up with this awesome recipe. You ready? Let's go! Alright guys, so we need to multitask a little bit here. We're gonna start with our noodles. I'm using black bean spaghetti. Shout out to Edamama. They're this really cool <coughs> company here in Switzerland. They make really amazing stuff with when it comes to noodle stuff. I'm also going to add a little bit of salt to our noodles. Just a little bit. Let's see, let's just give this a quick there we go. Six minutes. While my noodles are cooking, I'm going, to, I'm going to add some olive oil. I would say around two tablespoons. We do need a little bit of a big quantity here. So we're going to let this get a little bit uh, warm. And then we are going to add our garlic and then our shallot, all right? We're going in with our shallot and with our garlic. Oh, someone texted me. There we go. Three minutes have passed. This is going to be ready in three minutes. Yeah, it's really that fast. So do not let your garlic go brown. You really don't want that. So at this moment, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to add some butter. There we go. I splashed the whole place. It's okay. It's okay. It's time to add our muscles, so don't be scared to just stick your hands in there. There we go. Beautiful. They come with a little bit of that beautiful salty water. Don't worry about it. That's going to add up to the flavors. My spaghettios are ready. So. Let me just give him a quick stare and let's remove him from there. All right, so we're just gonna let this rest for a couple of seconds while I bring this to a little bit of a high heat and I'm going to add my wine, all right? A splash of wine would be cool. There we go. So this is gonna be our cue, guys. Once our muscles open, that means that they're ready. They don't have to all open, don't worry about that. Don't get stressed over it. But most of them have to. In my case, all of them are still pretty darn close. So we are just going to cover up to cover this up for a sec. All right, you guys, so while our mussels are getting cooked right here in that beautiful sauce, we are just going to grab our parsley, chop a handful. I would say something like this, like literally a handful. It doesn't have to be perfect. And do not be afraid of adding those stocks. Those stocks are amazing, there's nothing wrong with them. Just make sure you, like if, when it comes to the stocks, you don't want to have a big bloody chunk in there. So let's just make sure the stocks are actually kind of fine. And then with, with the leaves, just, you know, a very quick chop. And this is going to be perfect. Ooh. It's amazing though. There we go. So we are going in with this beautiful parsley. We're just going to food uh, gasm, man. Seriously. So at this moment, it's time to go in with our spaghetti. All right, you guys. So this is very close to be finished. I'm just letting my pasta soak on those beautiful flavors and then I'm just going to change my pan to a little bit of a bigger one because unfortunately this is the biggest I've got. 
but don't be scared. Got your back check. I'm just going to add a little bit extra parsley and some wedged tomatoes. And that's it. That's pretty much it, you guys. Alright guys, so there you have it, a very very simple recipe. I think it's the easiest recipe I've ever made in this channel and probably one of my favorite ones so far. So I strongly advise you to give it a try and remember, if you liked it, give me a big thumbs up, always subscribe and if you've got any questions, let me know in the comment section down below. I would love to hear from you guys. So remember, this is Jeff from my cook, Pedro and Germán and I'll see you soon. Bye!